YouTube Zodiacs, what's good is your favorite Gemini cast, the Gemini, back with another video, uh, back with a collectible versus community edition. So, you know, today we got up uh, some heavy hitters, man, some heavy hitters in the statue game, SciShow Collectibles versus off with XM Studios. Um, now, as you got, you guys know, we love SciShow over here. XM does the thing as well. But as you can see from the background, it's... I'm a sideshow boy, baby. I'm a sideshow boy. So today we do have the Ghost Rider going up against Sideshow versus uh, XM Studios. And, you know, we put out the polls. We put the polls in not one but two places. The polls were in the YouTube page for the uh, collecting uh, the community tab, as well as the Facebook group, the Cash and Out Collecting Community. So the plan is to put one out every Friday, every Monday. We'll drop the video on the Friday after giving you guys 72 hours. However, circumstances, special circumstances, sometimes the videos will go out a little bit more frequently, such as the Sideshow Superman versus the Prime One Studios Superman Hush. That'll be the next one, by the way. So with that being said, let's go ahead and dive in and share with you guys to see uh, exactly who won? I mean, it's crazy, man. Hey, I thought, I'm not going to lie. At first, I thought it was going just strictly XM. But then it, it started to sway a little bit. It started to sway a little bit. That's all I'm going to say. So as you guys can see on the screen here, we do have the X, uh, I said XM. We do have the Sideshow. We have the Sideshow Ghost Rider in all its glory. It's lit up, man. It's lit up like a Christmas tree, man. Um, now, the half bike doesn't bother me at, at, at all. I know this has been the biggest gripe amongst most people. The half bike does not bother me. And the, and the main reason why it doesn't bother me is because if you look at Daniel Bell Silver Surfer with the half board, at first I'm like, what is this? It's a half board. This is preposterous. Preposterous. But in all reality, it works. It just works. And uh, I love that Silver Surfer. I generally do. So with that same ideology thinking i'm thinking this ghost rider is going to be exactly the same far as the present still gonna have the presence still gonna have you know this and that and then seeing the fire that they did on the frankie ray with the silver surfer is you see where i'm going with this that's why i'm pretty much like yeah i, I I'm, I'm digging this one here i'm digging this one here but uh, let me go ahead and show you guys the uh, xm studio before we go any further uh, let me just zoom in real quick on this one here oh 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 my god Look at that Ghost Rider baby making Nicholas Cage proud. Yeah, making Nicholas Cage proud. Okay, we got XM Studios, man. Y'all know this is the vintage one. This is one of their most iconic classic pieces that always holds its value. Love the fire. Love the full bike on this one. On this one, it just it just works for what they were doing at that time. Uh, nothing bad that I can say about it. Now, my guy, the BBC vice president. Your anime god, King Buck Fang, seems to think this is outdated. I don't think it's outdated, but I don't think it compares. But it's not about what I think. This is community edition. It's about what you think. So, with that being said, what we're going to do first and foremost is we're going to head over to the YouTube uh, community tab. That's where we got to show you guys that, man. Because y'all went a little crazy on that part, man. So, let me stop sharing real quick here presents you guys the youtube tab like i said y'all went a little y'all went a little crazy over here man uh so i told you guys i said i need some input from the zodiac game which one four scale ghost rider do you recommend and why um sideshow was sculpted by jorge Villar and daniel bell coming in at 11 1110 dollars plus tax and shipping meanwhile xm is coming from the aftermarket the minimum that I've seen, by the way, that's why I said fifteen hundred, is mostly twenty two hundred, eighteen hundred, but fifteen hundred plus shipping sculpted by Adam Ross. If I'm not mistaken, correct me if I'm wrong. Both have their pros and cons. This time, I will save mine for the video, and we will see what's happening. So, Sideshow ended up getting forty percent of the votes, and this got a whopping fifty eight votes. By the way, fifty eight votes. So, sixty percent say they still pick an XM while 40% says they're going with Sideshow. Ugh. But let's go ahead and check out some of the comments. Remember, when we do these community verses, this is all about your vote. Some of these will just be me and a guest, but this is all about your vote, man. Has to be, man. It has to be. 
First up, man, I picked up the XM, but both are sick. If money isn't a factor, I would honestly buy both. There is also a pretty sweet custom, shout out Jarhead, uh, on the market with Ghost Rider on horse. Okay. Lord Vader says, XM, you won't be disappointed. Ooh. All right, man. Let's see. We got another comment here, man. Um, next time I will go ahead and uh, screenshot these so we can kind of embiggen them. So my, my apologies on that, but I, but I am reading them off. I have the Sideshow one on order since I need a Ghost Rider for the collection, but I do like the XM one a lot. But the Sideshow's light up is insane and might be the best light up they have ever put on a statue. But again, how often are you lighting these up each day? Okay, okay. My guy, the Dark Knight, says I like the new one. The XM looks good, but it's kind of boring. He is just popping a willy. <laughs> he just popping a willy. You dig what I'm saying? But so on the on the YouTube tab again, 58 votes, 60% of you guys said XM, 40% did say side show. So that's crazy uh to kind of see those type of votes, man. Now let's head over to the cash and out collecting community and see how many people voted over there as well as just what the percentage is, man. See what y'all really going with XM on this, man. All right. Wow. So it's a little bit closer over here. So over here, um, we got 51% says XM, while 49% says uh, Sideshow. That's crazy, man. It looks like that uh, that was... Wow, okay. Let's go to the comments here, see what we say. Check out some of these comments. This picture is very compelling. I would still wait and see. I think Sideshow may price this one higher than the market can bear. Now, see, I do agree on the price point. I'm not going to lie. On the price point, and again, next one, I'm going to screenshot these so we can kind of embiggen them and stuff. But just bear with us here on this one. Just the first time coming back. You did, but y'all know how we do. In my opinion, the Sideshow piece is more dynamic. Man, talk your stuff, Joe Mo. XM Scarp is dated. Shout out the anime God King Buck Fangs, man. BBC represent Buck. XM Scarp is dated. Has bad paint and is fire on the new side. Show looks good. I wouldn't recommend XM's even if it was significantly cheaper. If possible, wait for Sideshow production to release so you can make the best comparison. Make sure you look at videos of production versions of the XM and not prototypes. Oh, bad paint. XM Fire looks way better than Sideshow. Oh, man, it's getting a little dicey. It's getting a little dicey, baby. Oh, man. I just put this in bait time, man. Not when Sideshow is lit up for me. I like the new XM Ghost Rider on horse. Never been fond of the OG. Agree to disagree on this one. Just giving my cash my thoughts, man. Um, Let's see here. OG XM equals quality, and you get a full bite. Sideshow is only great when it's lit up. It's a gimmick. Wait for YouTuber reveals and real collector posts on the Sideshow one. Look at the issues with the shitty Green Lantern. Wow, that just came out. That's amazing Dark Knight statue. Hey, Sideshow, that's your boy Evan. Evan, whoo, coming in hot with the hot fire take, man. Let's be respectful, Evan. Let's be respectful, my brother. Jimmy, so for me, I'm going Sideshow. Everyone says OG is half bite. But I'm looking at it from a space perspective, which is every collector's enemy. Also, it's a very nice piece. Don't get me wrong. XM is awesome. But I feel like it's best display option if he's from the side, like the picture. My guy, Punisher, says, I picked a side show on the light up, the security of not dealing with aftermarket, and it looks more appealing to me. Both are very good. I just like the extra idea of a light up. Makes for great pictures. Piggy Pig says, side show. Your vision says, XM boss for me i don't like the sideshow unless it's lit up wow a couple more comments man sideshow has more uh, shelves presence you can look look at it head up and it lights up eye catching and say space all around her nice guy says i say sideshow you can enjoy it from multiple angles xm is still nice but it's only best display option is at the at the bike going forward the right so you can see the whole body and portrait have him have him to the left and his arm blocks half his body in detail. Just my opinion. If you had XM, do you need to replace it with the Sideshow? Probably not. But if I had the choice to get one from scratch, Sideshow has my pick right now. Based on the production unboxing, it looked good, not lit up. But even better lit up. 
So win either way if it's lit or unlit, man. Shout out to you guys, man. Like I said, uh, uh, next time I'm definitely gonna make sure I screenshot those so we can uh, put them up here, man. So I appreciate that from you guys, man. But with that being said, um, in my so I give you guys my takes. I'm just gonna share some pictures as well, real quick. So in my honest opinion, I love I love the sideshows one personally. I think the sideshow one is the best Ghost Rider that I've honestly ever seen. That's whether it's from Customs, that's whether it's XM. Um, or other licensed companies who have done one in smaller and smaller scales. I'm personally going to be picking up the uh, the Sideshow Ghost Rider. I've always wanted a Ghost Rider. Now, for me, the light up is just the extra icing on the cake. The light up doesn't define it for me. But I do like the fact that if I want to light it up, if I'm doing a room tour, taking pictures, I'm just trying to show somebody off. Or hell, if I just if I'm just watching Nicolas Cage Ghost Rider and I just want this bad boy lit up while I'm watching a movie. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. Shout out Nicolas Cage, by the way, man. I, I know y'all some Nicolas Cage haters, but shout out Nicolas Cage, man. This Ghost Rider is perfection in my personal opinion. Again, I love the half bike idea. I generally love the half bike idea. And shout out Daniel Beasy, aka Lazy D, baby. Lazy D in the building, man. Um, when they did this right here, I said, oh shit. You remember when Tupac, when Tupac had the had the bottle, he was like, you know what I'm saying? That's how I kind of felt, man. Shout out Tupac, man. This Ghost Rider is fire. No pun intended, man. Um, especially with the price point, it's still cheaper than what you're gonna get the 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 competitions. And the competition might come broke, and you have to file a claim with eBay, a file with UPS or FedEx, and then you're not gonna get your money back. And there's gonna be a whole few. I'm gonna buy this, get it cheaper, get reward points, get it in hand. If anything goes wrong, I can hit up the best customer service in the game. The best customer service in the game, baby. Sideshow. So I'm going with Sideshow on this for your bang, for your buck, man. Um, I am going to leave a description, leave a link in the description. If you guys do want to pick up the Sideshow version, go ahead and click that link on the bio. And if you guys are looking for the Examon bike, hit me up in the comments or hit me up on the Facebook uh, group, the Cash Now Collecting Community Group. I do have a buddy who is selling his Ghost Rider uh his xm ghost rider for a pretty good pretty good deal as well so that's something that you guys would want um he's a trusted seller um he's not on not on facebook not on youtube or anything like that but i can get you guys uh the information so you guys can pick up that xm from him if you so choose but with that being said click that link in the description you guys can pick up the side show if you choose and um i mean damn i i don't even have much more to say but i'm picking this up and i can't wait to unbox it Man, this thing is hot fire. Hot fire, man. Uh, remember to like, share, comment, subscribe, and all that. We'll be back for the next uh, community edition with the Sideshow Superman versus the Prime One Superman. I didn't do it right away because I wanted it to marinate. I know if I did it, I know if I did it yesterday, everybody was gonna pick Prime One just because it was it was the hot take. It was the hottest of the hot. Let that thing marinate. You know what I'm saying? A little foreplay, if you will. For the adults out there. Gotta let it marinate sometimes. And once it's marinated in season like a good steak, mm, right to the belly. You dig what I'm saying, man? But I appreciate you guys for coming through um, and all that, man. Cash the Gemini, we back. Join us Saturdays for the Broke Boys Club. You dig?